Hey there, welcome to module number four. In this module, we're gonna be discussing the leadership principle of challenging the process. And this might be my favorite of the leadership principles because I think the idea of it, finding and implementing new and better ways of doing things in order to consistently improve and consistently grow is probably one of the most important but perplexing dilemmas that face most organizations within the sports industry. So if, if your organization is able to do that, to look outside of your organization, to recognize trends that are going to impact your industry and adapt and change um, in response to those things, and you can do that in a way that's nimble and um, accommodating to your business situation, then that's when you have great success. As a leader, there's a couple of things that you can do right away to start fostering this practice of challenging the process. The first is really giving due to any new ideas that are presented. So don't immediately discount them because they are too big or too challenging or they came from the wrong people. Because while change and innovation requires discipline and um, thoughtfulness, they also require a lot of risk taking and letting other people be involved in that process. Also, spend less time on reviewing and reporting on results for projects that are already happening and more time pursuing new possibilities. Also remember that the practice is challenge the process, not talk about challenging the process. So this pursuit really requires more than simply surfacing new ideas and discussing new possibilities. You really, as a leader, must allow people the opportunity to experiment, to create, to innovate, because only in doing that can you really hope to achieve new results and new solutions to new and old problems. Lastly, one of the most critical things you can do to challenge the process is not apply old logic to new problems and new solutions. So in too many places, we get into the habit of doing things a certain way because it's the way that we've always done it. So in this module, we're going to look at one aspect of working in the sports industry and try to approach it from a new perspective. I look forward to seeing your work at the end of the module. And as always, if you have any questions, please post them to the Q&A board or shoot me an email. Have a great week.